in this example we will see how to declare initialize and display a variable in excel vba programming understand with example i'll go to developer tab and here we have option as insert we can see form controls and active x controls from active x controls i'll select command button and i'll drag a command button here then i'll double click on this command button to go to vba editor window where i can write vba code on the back end or on the click event of this command button there is a shortcut command to reach to vba editor that is alt and f11 so let me double click on this command button so here we will understand with example how to declare initialize and display variable in excel vba programming we can use keyword as dim then name of variable let's say a and then type of value that we want to store in this variable i'll use as then space now vba automatically shows the window where we can choose what kind of variable we want out of this entire list here i just want to declare this variable as integer i'll press enter then formatting is done automatically so dim is the keyword that we can use a is the name of variable and in a variable we can store integer type of value that is numeric or number now this is declaration part now next part is initialization that is assigning value to declared variable so here i can say a equal to 5 so i am assigning 5 to a variable this is assigning or i would say initializing a variable now i want to display the value stored in a variable i can use message box or i can display on sheet as well so on sheet i want to display this value in cell a1 so what i can write i can write directly range in bracket i'll say a1 dot value equal to a so this is displaying value in a1 cell so this is declaration part this is initialization or assigning value to declared variable and this is how i am going to display value in a1 so let me minimize this vba editor window and then i'll double click on this command button not double click i'll click on design mode so that i am out of design mode and now i'll click on this command button we can see 5 is written in a1 cell we can declare variable of different data types like integer string double or boolean boolean we use for true and false so let's try one more type of declaration so this time let me declare this variable a as string and then i'll assign value to this a as hello world now this a is storing a string value and then whatever is stored in a will be displayed in a1 so let me minimize this vb editor let me delete this file i'll click on the, this command button we can see that hello world is written so this is how we can declare any variable and then we can make use of those variables in our vba programming thanks for watching this tutorial for more advanced tutorial 
प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग